it's definitely been interesting to work on this. Um, but it's, it's, at the minute, it's not too bad. Obviously, it's in the way being on our floor space, effectively. Um, we've still managed to get on with uh, some, of the, some of the other stuff, like I've actually started building the next set. I'm building the mice in there. Um, I'm doing all the steel work for it, hence why I'm so lucky. Um, yeah, I'm doing the steel work for that in, in the metal shop. It's really interesting for me because we've actually got something that's 3D now, whereas normally our work, although we have 3D things in it, it's mainly 2D work, it's, it's floor work that we do. So this has really been interesting. It's so such on a grand scale as well. It's like them bookcases uh, are as high as our mezzanine out here. I think they're... Um, nearly 10 metres high or something like that, maybe a bit less than that, um, but yeah, it's certainly, it's certainly been interesting to work on. It's 12 panels of perspex um, and uh, we use sticky back lead in, uh, so it looks real. <laughs> and we use a stencil underneath the perspex to get the right pattern in as we put the leading on um, then we've added kind of a, a glass effect in between to make the glass look quite wobbly and uh, oldie worldy so that's a, a Roscoe product how did, you, how did you create that wobbly effect? what is that, the it's glass effect? it's literally like um, a glass paint but it's a water based glass paint that Roscoe do to the company that use roll paints and you just paint it on literally and let it it, it pooled into the surfaces and so you get a nice nice effect and it does mean that when we're putting on this kind of colour it's quite like a, a blacky brown kind of a, a breakdown colour that it will kind of stick to the surface of it and the undulations of it and it'll look quite nice it'll look old Old. Which is the idea. <laughs> <laughs> We're trying to build this for down London. There's also a different kind of setup for up here. We've got to, we've actually got to cut out the floor that fits our our layout down down the road. Whereas this obviously is a different stage layout. It's a regular well a proscenium layout. So. Sure. Yeah. Um, yeah, the floor layer is different, so effectively we're building two different sets for one show.